Is this it ringing? Hello, SPQR helpline. Do you want to, would you like to talk? Uh, Alana here. So, can you just introduce yourself? Oh, of course. Um, well, my name's Peter, and this is. Would you like to say hello yourself, Rebecca? Hello, I'm Rebecca, apparently. Oh, hey, yeah. Uh, Becky or Bex. <laughs> Formal hello. names, please. My name's Jeff. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, there we go. Oh, damn it, no, I've, I've just forgot my question. Hang on. Oh. Don't worry, don't worry, no, I'm, I'm, I'm nervous too. <laughs> we all get nervous. Stage fright. Oh, wait, no, 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 okay, so, how did the band come about? How did it come about? Right, have you got, have you got half an hour? <laughs> That's just a joke. It's just a joke. Um, are you ready for a bit of a story? Oh, a bit of story time. Oh, yeah, I was doing on. an acoustic thing, I was doing an acoustic thing, and then, but I always, I really like heavy music, I like... Uh, quite really heavy music, and I thought I'd like to start a band that's heavy music. And then, so I uh, enlisted. I found Rebecca on uh, on the internet um, on joinmyband.com. Oh yeah. And, um, yeah, we met up, and it was great. And then I enlisted a bassist. Um, he's not with us anymore, sadly. He's not dead. <laughs> he is actually dead. He's not, <laughs> he's dead. He's not dead. <laughs> He's not dead, he just fucked off, he might, he's dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Anyway, go on. And then we found Jack, you haven't mentioned Jack. Oh, we found Jack, sorry. You forgot sorry, Jack. Jack. Uh, Jack's quite, alive, Jack's, I'm alive, I'm well. Alive, I'm well. Jack's been in the band for about a month, he picked up the songs, we did three practices before our first gig with Jack. He picked it up straight away, he was fantastic, he fits in really well, he just, um, it's lovely to be around, and um We love yeah, Jack. We love Jack. Oh. <laughs> Oh. Oh. <laughs> what, what are your influences at Well, the I have one main influence, which is Jamie T. Do you know Jamie T? You know what? I don't. I feel like I should. Go on, enlighten me. Right, well, Jamie T is, is a. An inf- I just like Jamie T a lot, and it doesn't really sound like that in the music because, you know, you've got to do your own thing, but. Yeah. Yeah. You don't know Jamie T? <laughs> oh Get on God, Jamie he's T! He's so good! <laughs> he's so good. Right, let's kind of pass you over to uh, Jack Sanders. Hello. <laughs> so what are you listening to? Um, I, I like funk music. Oh I really? Yeah, I can't believe you said that. Um, and that, that's it. Funk and more funk. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a recovering funkaholic. Oh what? Oh, was we gave funny? him the fucking phone. Mainly like, uh, like 70s stuff, but a bit of early 80s and some modern stuff as well. I mean. I like that that song Bruno Mars did recently. It's only called Carrot Magic, but it's quite good. <laughs> oh, go on, go on, sing a bit, of Bruno. A little, a little bit of Twenty Four Carrot Magic. Uh, sing it, Jack. I, I, I don't know. Why are you <laughs> sing it, Jack. Liar, go on. I, I I don't even know the words. I just know it's like it's groovy and I like just it. Do the groove. Do uh, the groove. I, yeah. Y- you know what? You know we should go. To, to where? Down Baltic. <laughs> Uh, no? <coughs> there's um, there's a great funk and soul night on, well, there's regular nights it's on at uh, 24 Kitchen Street. Oh, I'll have to get down to that. Yeah, just try it out. I will. It's costing a fortune. Uh, yeah, it's a premium gonna... rate. Okay, yeah, here's Bex. What am I doing? Ask Tuna a question. Hello? Hey, yeah. Hi. <laughs> and what was your earliest uh, experience in music? Uh, yeah, probably. I remember using some chopsticks with bouncy balls on the end of them on the sofa on cushions, playing along to uh, Queen. Oh, yeah. So Roger Taylor. So that was probably when I was about six years old. Oh, that's a real answer. Um, yeah, so real. that was probably where it all started. And then um, I remember one Christmas, my mum got me this little, t- you know, like the little kids' drum kits. Oh, it was, it was yeah, called, I think it was called like a hawk or something. And I got one of them, and I remember. The family sat around and I just sat on it and like played it and they were all like, what the hell? And then uh, my technique hasn't really developed much since then, to be honest. It's quite similar to when I was a six-year-old kid. Did you take uh, like music classes at school then? You know, like how kids do like violin after school? Well, yeah, kind of. But then like I played for uh, like a couple of years when I was like 14 and then I stopped playing for 10 years. And then it's only recently that I got back into it and, and found this these bunch of tits. And, I bought a house and I had a spare room, so I thought, well, I know what I can put in it, a drum kit. And the neighbours were like, yeah, this is great. That's awesome. I'll pass you back to, to Pete. Hello. Hi, you again. 
Have you got any uh, gigs coming up this summer? Do we have any gigs coming up oh, this summer? Um, God. Yes, oh, yes, we are in the process of record. Oh, fucking hell, what am I trying to say here? <laughs> <laughs> We're in the process of booking a tour. Um, June, July time. So we're getting uh, getting some dates for that at the moment, um, and that'll be kind of all across the UK, hopefully. Oh, yeah. nice! <laughs> Get out there again, you know. Spread the seed. Did you Did you just really say that? Seed. Seed. It's horrible. <laughs> Don't pull that in. <laughs> okay. I quite like it, actually. <laughs> I didn't mean that. <laughs> What's been your favourite, favourite moment in the band? My favourite moment in the band? Oh. Oh. Just playing now in the phone box? Yeah, actually, yeah. just playing now in the phone box. No. no. I mean, it is. It's a highlight. <laughs> but unfortunately, I think we've had some... Um... Oh, um, I've got one. Oh, yeah, go on. So, at a gig um, a few weeks ago, we we had we have a two singles out and the second single is called Plink and it has like a, a a bit where kind of all the instruments cut out and it's just me singing. Yeah. And um, when that happened at this particular gig, the crowd was singing along and that was a bit of a like. Oh wow. Hi Ma, I'm famous. Kind of moment. So that. That was, must feel so incredible. We do feel good because you know we put a lot of us musicians put a lot of work into what we do and you're having no a crowd asked. of strangers thinking your song your yeah. lyrics that's just, that's just amazing it, it is thank you so jealous awesome so uh to finish off can you just introduce the song you're going to play for k 2 okay i'm going to do it into the camera okay the song you're about to watch is called or so i say acoustic version i'm pete this i'm Max. Is... i'm too slow jack <laughs> what's your name jack he's jack <laughs> Enjoy. Right. Phones Bye. down. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. Right. Oh. <laughs> Come on. I won't. I will. My life. Your will. My blood. You spill. I won't now I won't I will my life your will your love and it's not my body anyway or so I say it's okay, abuse, love, love, sick, make me out of my dream So stale, my dream so stale I need realness Tight and loose to leave it be I need relief Take life from me to feed the beast Ooh, They're coming to find you Animal life designed by this creature The black dog jack and movements of the death carriage The fresh frontier jack down into the chasm I need release Tighten loose and leave it be I need relief Or take life from me to feed the beast Ooh, they're coming to find you So
at the door say sir can you help me I'm losing love I can't remember why I'm so special special Oh, no. Fucking hell, man. <laughs> 